Yo, what is up, everybody? Welcome back to Neon Genesis React Andy. Today, pretty hyped up. I'm excited. Episode 12. Um, let's see. Last time, episode 11, we fought the giant spider monster that was acid gooping down the shaft. Um, we think there's somebody in Nerve that is like working in cohorts with the Angel Squad because somebody ultra like messed up the power systems, uh, which was bad news considering the tech society kind of wants power um we also met in a way we we got information that the leaders of the democratic ish government are supercomputers which there's three of them and i don't quite remember the names but there are three supercomputers that are the um like leaders right um and Hmm. The three kids, the first, second, and third child, you know, Rei, Asuka, and Shinji, they were doing pretty well working together, throwing some like group hands and such to slay Monster Man. Shinji's been doing really well, uh, in my opinion. You know, he's been like, he has good relationships with people. Um, He hasn't gone berserk sicko mode in a really long time in like nine episodes or so so hey big big round of applause for homeboy shinji really pulling through um ray is still all freaking like stone cold steven austin um looking and asuka is still uh waifu material uh misato is always the best Father is always kind of sussy, Baka. I'm sorry, I gotta stop with that. And uh, yeah, I feel like that's most most of what I gotta say about that. And guess what? We're gonna mix something up a little bit. We're actually gonna watch the intro. Um, and I'm just gonna probably butcher it in post production. So, because I we haven't watched a little bit, I want to like with more information kind of get a look. So, three, two, one. Right, okay, so we, a lot of the, that religious imagery we're still working with. Which is cool, considering that the uh, monsters do look like, uh, kind of like angel depictions from the Bible, right? Like how they were described, which is cool. It feels like a parody of itself, just because I've seen this parodied so many times. I think that's a Suka and Rei, right? Going both ways. Oh, and he smiles thinking about them r slash wholesome misato booba right at the window we're doing some mechy stuff it's it's kind of a jammer i'm gonna be real i love yo the spy we haven't seen that i don't think that like spider form Uh, those are a lot of the assistants and stuff. There was the, uh, freaking Adam in there. A crying... Uh, it, dude, it goes so fast. <laughs> For a second, there was what looked like a young Shinji, like, on the side of the road crying or something, dude. I don't know. Oh, wait, it might be getting info. Wait, this could be big. Fifteen years ago. Oh, and they're all fourteen, right? So this is a uh, second impact stuff, right? Hopefully, my timeline's about right there. This looks very. Oh, is this where Misato got her scar? Young Misato put in the vault, and the father dies all on top of it. Yo, what is going on? Yeah, that's the second impact, or the first impact, it looks like, right? Holy, yo, that's terrifying. That 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 looks kind of like the spider thing from the intro on the back of um. Jeez, man. 
Sorry, distracted. Shinji's mecha had the like. It looked kind of like that. The value of a miracle. Dang. Okay, so she. We just got a little bit of Misato trauma. Let's go, Misato. Homeboys in the chat. Let's go with you, homeboy one and two. <laughs> Poor sick. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Who would want to see her changing clothes? Oh, okay, we're good. Misato is clothed. Dang, she got long legs. Oh. Climbing that corporate ladder, Misato, I see you. I mean, yeah, she's kind of been popping off, like, with Shinji and all that. Okay. Captain the Major, right? Major Misato in the chat. True. Fostering both Shinji and Asuka is a lot on the human mind. Are they... What was it, harmonics, she said? Are they trying to harmonize with their, their juice? Oh, Shinji's the best one. Mental toxicity? Yo, he's, he's like the perfect pilot. And he started to catch up to Asuka, who's been like practicing a lot, I'd, I'd imagine, right? Hey, let's go. Yeah, you're getting caught up on. Asuka, stop being a dick. Back! Mr. Wa of Tokyo 2 is <laughs> Mr. Wa. <laughs> Oh, that's nice of him to bring that up. I'm trying to read both the top and bottom. It got me kind of messed up. Oh, why Asuka's mad? Dude, Asuka's mad because she's into you, dude. Yeah. Aw, they're throwing a little party. Oh, look, Penguin is chilling with the class president. Good job, Aida Kensuke. Yeah, why is the class rep here? That's a good question. Aw. Aw, they're friends! Oh, Ray didn't, didn't pull up? Kind of true. Kaji! Kaji! Homeboy Kaji! Okay, yeah, he's the, uh... The one that was schlozing on to Misato, schlozing on to other girl. Freaking brought the... Got on the airplane with Adam and Eve and zoomed off into Fatherland. Social freaking wallflower looking. Dang, they are loud. 
Who's <laughs> which one of them screaming? <laughs> oh, that's really funny. That one right there, that scream. <laughs> she wants to. No, it's because because she was I forget everyone died in her family because of the angels, so she wants to throw some angel hands. Ray. <laughs> oh, oh, it is Kaji. Lame. I tried it. That's a little suspicious. I don't trust Kaji at all. Wait, what? I didn't, I didn't know. Yeah. That's interesting. Why are they at the South Pole? What is that? Oh, is this where the other uh, thing happened? The South Pole? Dude, it looks scary. There's like spires of ice. It does look like hell. That's what caused it? Were they like Balrog d d dug too deep, dwarf looking? And then in. This is a world that's been purified. Like, did they. They did something that caused the uh, impact? Detected in orbit. Wait, okay, so they're appearing from orbit. They can appear from orbit and from inside the Earth? Where, wait, where are they coming from? What is that? That is ridiculous. What the hell? What? Is, what? It's like a satellite. Like an angel satellite? Is this, what is that, psychic? Using it to crush stuff? Oh! Is that a missile? It's shooting AT field? It's like that satellite project that like was supposed to like shoot like freaking rods or whatever, if you know what I'm talking about. It's weird because they're like biological things they look like, right? And that they have a lot of similarity to humans in DNA. Oh. And it's got electric jam j j j j j j jamming. And Magi is the uh, supercomputer. Alright. Hey, if we're going down, we're not taking the home homeboy civilians with us. I love how they just <laughs> the city back up. It's so cool. I don't get that. There's so much like empty space. It, it feels like, I don't know. What? Why are we in the lavatory? It says who? Some computer. <laughs> you hoe? So you get for taking my man. Not protecting humanity, destroying angels. Yeah, it's the revenge. You got called out. You got called out hard. She said, don't make others suffer for your personal hatred. Right?
Oh, the missile? Or is the entire angel gonna... Oh, it's shooting little bits of itself to learn, and then it's gonna go in, in itself and dive? God only knows. Ooh, that's a good line. How are you supposed to, like, reasonably fight against an orbital bombardment angel, right? Like, it's tough. They're having to write a will? Suka doesn't think she's gonna die. Rei has no soul. And Shinji just follows the crowd. It's a cool freaking prep room though. Oh my goodness, glass. <gasps> Yo, don't tear into her. She's She's trying her best. Suka, shut up. Yeah. You're walking around with Tor Tokyo Gourmet. <laughs> uh, we'll get vegetarian, bro. They have to guess. Yeah, and you're supposed to catch it. Oh, so only one gets to catch it. A woman's intuition. This Misato has never won the lottery. Hey, she's saving all our luck for now. That's a good, thank you. Yeah, good question. Okay, she's prideful. I mean, they have a. He has gotten a booba a little bit in the past. I ain't, I ain't gonna forget it. Yeah, and she backs down when he. Oh. Yo. That's so hype. The three, the three mechs. She's go. She's one man shipping it. Oh. Their AT okay, so what's an AT field powered by if both angels and mechs get them? And mechs are the only ways that humanity has to get them, I think? I I feel like it's coming from the pilots something being amplified, maybe? Like some sort of psionic field. Oh, she hates her dad, too. Yeah, just like Shinji hates his dad. At the very end, though, he saved her life over his. Which is something. Yeah, kick him to the curb. Oh, and I bet that's the cross. He might have given that cross to her or something like that. Right. Yeah, she wants to avenge her father. 
or maybe Okay, he, that was a that was not that was a Shinji trauma, and that was the thing from the beginning that I mentioned. Like with the we saw a flash of uh, child sh child Shinji being all scared, like crying on the road, maybe abandoned by the father. But dude, I don't know. Like seven things flashed on the screen, and my brain is not that uh, super fast. Oh, it's diving. But at least uh, Misato and Shinji have that in common, that they both don't like their dad. Or, well, at least have a really um, odd, kind of uh, confusing relationship with them, right? <laughs> screw, your, screw your wheat field. Yo, the freaking uh, jump, the Olympics. Yo, he's going fast. Oh, the pose. You all, you Shinji. The other two better be coming to back it up now that they figured out which one it's at. Oh, yep. And his arm, like, is starting to juice. Oh, don't you dare fight over it. Both just go help. Yeah. Yes. Oh, and they're starting to shank at it, too. He, like, cut it open like a film. Oh, shanked in the, shanked in the juice. Oh, and then, like, a pancake. An explosive pancake. Um, I mean, it was said their AT fields would protect them, right? Even if the mechs are damaged? That thing was just a nuke. Easy dub. Point zero 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 one percent. Like no shot, not. I don't know what computer made that up, but that is not true. He's gonna be like, "Nah, you did good." Yeah. You did good, Misako. Damn me up, damn me up. And that's the vice, the vice person, right? That said that. Because he he held that off by himself for a good second there, and the entire the entire guy before um homegirl homegirls pulled up and like gave the assist. Uh oh, I'm scared. <laughs> yeah, ramen. Yo, she's the freaking major for nerve at saving the entire planet, and she gets no roast pork. Oh, well, I'm. Is she, why is she so poor? She should be rich. Oh, was it the dad that said good work, Shinji? Is that why he was so conflicted? He wanted approval from, from father. Something he was lacking from childhood. Because he was abandoned. Question mark. Asuka, chill out. It ends? Oh my gosh, they ended so... No. Why do they do this to me, dude? Mid-conversation. And then she just says, you're an idiot. <laughs> oh. Alright, well, I'm... Before I freaking... I gotta find the... I'm finding the flashing imagery, and I'm fine, and I'm looking at it. Here it is, here it is. No, 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 a little behind this. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Shinji's sleeping. Shinji, uh, when, okay, he was, that was him sleeping, right? Um, and then this is him getting punched, and he's, like, looking away, um, and he accepts the beating, you know? 
because he's so like self-deprecation at that point, right? Um, that was like a shot of him looking this way, like straight on, edgy shot, him in the mech. There's were there more? There might have been more. Let me watch this again. Ah, spacebar, spacebar work, please. Okay, father, so I can free myself of him, right? Okay, so it looks like he gave the this is like bag to Shinji and said, "I, you're on your own, bucko." There's your pajamas and three pairs of pants and one pair of underwear. Enjoy. Him looking at the mech. His own confidential file, Shinji Ikari. Okay. So, I think that Shinji's dad abandoned him when he was young to go save the planet and work for Nerve, like, fully. Which is why he resonates so much with Misato's kind of stuff, right? And also... Oh, but then what is the whole I, I sh mustn't run away thing that he this is the second time he's like gone crazy with it oh I don't know what that means like what what are you running away from or what what did you run away from in the past like run away from your emotions because when he's saying this here um it cuts to like instances where he could be like running away from his like responsibilities of like the EVA mech or, like, when he was punched in the face, like, I don't know, maybe he's, like, running away from something, like, metaphorically? Or maybe, like, when he was abandoned, if he was abandoned. Uh, fits in there somehow. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Um, and then, what else? Anything? Uh, that was pretty sick. Oh, my gosh, I thought there was a cat in my room. That scared the junk out of me. Um, pretty sick with him freaking one man holding up the entire planet um and by planet i mean the angel that went skydive on him also how okay so angels can come from space right and they have a bunch of hu like they're 99 percent human dna right and they can be a fetus in the earth's mantle right how and the only things we've seen in the series that has the, like, AT field is Angels and the Mechie Boys. So, I think, theory time, right? I think the AT field comes from, a, like, human beings, right? Like, it's, like, a human thing that's being amplified through the mech. That's, like, part of the mech stuff. And then, like, there it is, right? And... The angels have it because they're, like, 99% human. And I think the angels came from, based on the stuff we were hearing when they were in the South Pole, when the commander and vice commander were like, ah, ah, choo -choo, and then went to the South Pole on the boat. Um, they are saying, like, this is hell. And then they were kind of saying some stuff that sounded like they had done something here that, like, caused everything to go wrong. Um... South Pole, yeah, like, it's, they, they say the quote, this is a greater punishment than we deserve, this, th there it is, that arrogance is what caused the tragedy of 15 years ago, the second impact, saying, like, the arrogance of science, the arrogance of, like, mankind's power, um, so, like, did the humans go to the South Pole, the most remote place they could think on the planet, and then do some crazy test where they're, like, I, we're opening Pandora's box, like scientifically kind of um and then that caused the angels to appear alongside like and this could be tied with how the mechs have the psychic powers and the kids are like tied to them and that all is like and you have to like resonate like get on the right mind field um and how the angels have the at field and like those like all that crap that's the best i got <laughs> that's the best i got whatever you get out of that is the best i got but hey uh, appreciate you watching with me. Appreciate you coming around for episode 12. Looking forward to episode 13. 13 is going to be the halfway mark in the series because there are 26 episodes. So I'm looking forward to that. Looking forward to seeing you there on the next episode of React Andy Neon Genesis Evangelion. But that is all for today. Uh, appreciate you sticking around. And I'm going to go watch episode 13, but you're going to have to wait or just go click on that if it's already out. I appreciate you. Hope to see you there. I'm out of here. Peace.